Hello, this is Nico G here. Welcome to the um, reaction video. And today we're getting to Shimu vs. Roar. And yes, I know I should have probably used the Roar's 60th anniversary tribute instead of a 70th anniversary tribute. So let's get that out of the way. <laughs> Didn't think that through. <laughs> Whoops. But with that said, we'll be watching Shimu vs. Ghidorah. And let's just say I haven't watched this yet, so this will be an budget reaction. <laughs> so let's watch, shall we? Look, she know in a hot story. Oh my god, that animation was so... No pun intended. <laughs> Man, this guy's gonna be epic. Oh. <laughs> 
Um, you're missing a head, Gadol. You mind going it back? We keep it in the movie. There you go. <laughs> oh, God. Why is that there? Come on, you know you could have had a cool animation death. As I'm in the midst of applying for residency right now, wish me luck, Grammarly has again been a lifesaver with my application. And help God, slick. You miss a good attempt. Mm. Okay, it's a cool fight, but the only downside to this is pretty much the ending. It's Oh my god, my screen might go small. Oh boy. There we go. The only downside to this is that the uh, ending. Not a big fan of. Yeah, um. Not a big fan of that ending. It's not. It's not. Bad. It's not. Just no. I am. Yeah, they could have easily. Slick, you are good with animation. We are good with kaiju depths. Come on, you know you could have easily had like the door die. Like Shimu was like in perfect condition with only wounds on him, and the door was like missing his wing. His wings all turned up. You know you could just have. A good animation death. Come on, slick. But to be fair, I don't know. Godot could probably be streaming many time because uh, Godot is pretty powerful. Um, Godot can literally terraform the planet, can literally change the weather around the entire fucking planet. Yeah, Shimo can do the same. She did create the Ice Age, so eh. But what are that? But that took time, and Ghidorah did it in about a couple hours. So, well, not a couple hours. He did it in, like, as soon as he woke up. He legit caused storms all over the planet. As soon as he woke up. Yeah, because if you notice that big old map on the screen where Mess Emma Russell's at, you notice there's a bunch of storms right there where Ghidorah is, and you also notice there's a bunch of storms all around the planet. So Ghidorah can just create storms all over the planet and 
most powerful swarm is where he's at. Like he legit tail from the planet to his likings just by his mere presence. So yeah. He's pretty intimidating. But I don't know. The battle was pretty cool. I ain't gonna lie. The suck battle, like I said, suck can never go wrong with animations. I I really want want suck to do an animation for me. (sighs) Hopefully, I really want suck to do an animation for me. Uh, Someday. Someday. But, yeah. I enjoy this. It's pretty good. That's about it. It's not one of six better animations. It is better than the Godzilla vs. X-Kong New Empire animation that he did a while back ago that we had to. I will say it's better than that. I wouldn't say it's better than Godzilla vs. Destroyer 4 cut or the Battle Royale Part 1 and Part 2. Or any of these other animations. I wouldn't say it's one of the worst animations he's done, but I wouldn't say it's one of his best. But to be fair, there really isn't no bad animation from Slick. I can't name one animation from Slick that's bad. Like, he is good with Slick nodes. So yeah. Well, with that said, is that going to sign off? And remember... Stay there, G-Fans!